I'm going to be showing the updates that they have made for WebDirect. It is now phone compatible. So what that means is they made all the dialogues uh, easier to read on the smaller screens, uh, some of the buttons bigger so that you can tap it easier. Uh, so we'll just go through and take a look at some of these examples. So I have FileMaker 14 here, and I also have FileMaker 15 here. So if we take a look as we open this up, first thing that we notice is they now have placeholder text for the login so that way it's easier for users to click into here uh, and enter in their information so we'll go ahead and log in to the next step and I'll log in on the other as well so we can continue and compare and contrast the changes that they've made The next thing that we can take a look at is the date. Uh, as we take a look at the FileMaker 14, this is how it looks now. Um, what they've done, if you see, pay close attention to the arrows and the size of the, the calendar dates, you can see that they've increased the size of those buttons, easier to tap, uh, increased the size of the dates, so it's easier to, to click the dates. And, and navigate to uh, different months or years. Um, they've also have added a button on here. As you can see, the, the custom dialog compared to the other one in FileMaker 14. If we click the custom dialog here, it, it's, the text is smaller on the FileMaker 14. And also in 14, you could click here and resize or, or move it around where they've taken that portion out and just said that you get the custom dialog, it's bigger, and it's, it's just going to show up centered in your screen. Another thing that we can look at in FileMaker 14, we can go ahead and try to sort, and it will come up with the same sort dialog look that you are used to on FileMaker Pro. And if we look on 15, they've they've updated it a bit to make it easier for smaller screens. Where now it is more uh, one step at a time. Let's you can add the field first, and then once you've added the field, you can then say, do you want it descending? You know, how do you want it to sort? Or you can remove it from the sort altogether. So now they they split it up into multiple screens so that they can have more real estate to put buttons and make the screen bigger and make the the uh, the text larger and again it's all about making it easier for the phone and then this similar thing happens in, in other dialogues if we if we look at uh, an insert dialog it's going to the buttons are larger and centered and easier again for tapping whereas FileMaker 14 it just did what uh, it just had it with, same as it would be for uh, larger screens, and so when it gets condensed, it it gets a little off centered. So we'll take a look at that in FileMaker 14 as well, and see what it, it gives us here. So see that the buttons are over here; they're smaller compared to FileMaker 15, larger and and e easier to work with. That is what we've seen so far, and again, they, they focused heavily on making WebDirect more phone-friendly so that you can, uh, with, whether it's with an Android or an iPhone, uh, you can connect to a database and be able to use it completely.